All right, let's do this. Let's do this. Okay, guys, I got a bunch of stuff to tell you. Bunch of stuff. Um, I got my coffee. I got my card. Today's the 12th. And today's day 30 of my taper. I can't believe it's day 30 already. Remember when it was day two, day three? Um, Michelle Obama said, we need to do a better job of putting ourselves higher on our own to-do list. And the action is, what have you been avoiding on your personal to-do list? Take a break, spend more time with loved ones, work smarter and not harder, prioritize them today. So there's your card. Put yourself higher on your to-do list. Get my coffee. I have a mini coffee. I have the Be Happy cup because I had a coffee earlier today. And I just had a whole handful of Swedish red fish that are different from a different company than the last ones I had that were super sweet that I had to just get rid of. But these are like the real and they're the little ones. And I just had like four. Mm. I opened up the Cafe Mocha. And I probably should have added a little more. That's not bad. Not bad. It's hard to figure out the the um, the amounts on the little cup, and you'll hear the fan in the background. It's not hot. I just wanted background noise. Okay. This has nothing to do with anything other than my neck or your neck. So because I'm older, because I'm almost five years away from seventy which I can't even fathom. Like when I think about it, it scares me a little bit. Um, I know growing older is a, is a gift, it said. But anyway, I'm gonna, I shared this before. Um, you know, I'm working on the hair. I've got the special shampoo and that seems to be helping, right? I'm working on the bangs. Haven't cut the bangs. I'm trying to get everything like that. Months ago, you guys remember months ago, I bought this little bottle of castor oil at the corner grocery store. It was $2.99 because I saw on TikTok, um, I have a TikTok, but I don't do anything on it because I don't know how. Uh, story of my life. But I saw that there were women talking about using castor oil on your neck for the turkey neck. And so for months, I've been uh, using a cotton ball and getting some castor oil and dabbing it all in here. And I pretty much, pretty much have gotten rid of all of the turkey neck. Yeah. You might want to try it. Like, it's not expensive. It took a while. It took a while to see any difference, but now I think I see a difference. I do, I see a difference. I like it. Not that I'm, I'm not ashamed of growing old. You can't stop um, the aging process, the experience process. That's good. Okay. Stacy, I have your S on for Sky. Stacy gave me this in yesterday's video. And I have the, the little bracelet with a little cross. Look how cute that is. So now I have my Stacy with an I bracelet along with my Stacy with a Y bracelet. And this is, this is Leo. This is the Leo <laughs> that I got for myself. But I got a package today. Um, this is from my friend Mary. Mary sent me the um, the gem art that I did, the 
turtle that I have hanging in the big window and the Amazon gift card that I was able to get the shampoo and the ink for my printer and the dehumidifier and the rosary beads. Um, she said, I got you a little something. Um, she said, it's something small, but Amazon just dropped it off. And I don't know, the box says about batteries. It says lithium batteries, lithium metal batteries in compliance with section two. So we're gonna open it. I have some heart skips. I don't get heart skips very often anymore. But um, maybe because I didn't, I didn't eat a whole lot today or whatever. I don't know. Okay, let's, let's do this. Let's not, let's not cut myself. this weird heart feeling. I don't get it often anymore because the metoprolol works really well. But I'm kind of feeling it. I wonder if I need another metoprolol. Maybe a half. Okay. Knife down. Not necessary. I'm always saying that. Like, please, please, please. Okay, let's see what we got. We got a card. A, a blank card. I'm going to use this for notes, Mary. I'm going to use this for notes. Okay. Happy birthday. When you open the birthday card, the music and lights automatically turn on and the lights glow in sync with the music. When you blow out the candle from a distance, cheers and applause sound out. If you encounter any issues with the birthday card, kindly reach out to Amazon. Okay. <coughs> All right. Um, we'll, we'll put that, we'll put that to last. Oh, Promises from God for Women. Got a little book. Promises from God to Women will speak directly to your heart. It offers topics ranging from blessings, wisdom, and gratitude to hope, love, and God's amazing grace. This is, this is very nice. This is very nice. Looks like this on the inside. So you have um, let's see let's go I'm, I'm gonna fill this in the to and the from your date and then it has a table of contents to it The number one says your beauty should not come from outward adornment. Rather, it should be that of your inner self, the unfading beauty of a gentle and quiet spirit. Thank you. So I'm going to add this with the book that I read each morning. Oh, shower rose, shower steamer. Use hot water for best results. Lavender. Okay. Let's see. Where's my knife? Oh. I have to see. And speaking of this, this lipstick. Stacey, this is the lipstick you sent me yesterday. I did use the lipstick and then I used the lip gloss over it. I didn't use the lip liner. I've never used lip liner, but I'm gonna try it. But I just wanted to try the new color. And the lip gloss isn't super sticky. It's not super sticky. 
I'm going to be using it a lot. All right, that's, oh, that smells good. I took the plastic off. I could smell it right away. Oh. So, do you just put these in the shower? This is what it looks like. So you just open them. What do you do? You open them up and you just you put them in the shower. And with the the water will give off the scent, right? Yeah. Thank you. Oh, because I'm always talking about my lavender baths. Now I can do lavender showers. Well, if this stuff doesn't calm me down, I don't know what will. Thank you. I never saw anything like this. Did you guys see stuff like this? I guess you open it up and put it in, like in the tub, and then the steam from the shower. Is that what you do? Fill me in. I think that's what you do. I'll Google it too. I'll Google it. But I think it's what you would do. Okay, now the card. <laughs> I got to admit, I'm almost afraid to open it. Um, there's an envelope. I'm not afraid, afraid, but you know what I mean. <laughs> Happy birthday. Okay. So what did it say? <laughs> I have to reread it now. When you open the birthday card, the music and lights automatically turn on and the lights glow in sync with the music. When you blow out the candle from a distance of three to five centimeters, cheers and applause sound out. Are we ready? Are we ready? Look at this. Blowing. <laughs> oh my god. I love this. Thank you, Mary. You know how much Sky would love to see something like this. I never saw anything like this. You know how many times I'm going to do this? Like a hundred. I'm going to do this so many times. This is so cool. Thank you. Mary said, I got you just three little gifts, or just little gifts. <laughs> and here I'm sitting here bawling my eyes out. Um, this is a heck of an emotional birthday. One, I'm finishing my 65th rotation around the sun. Not everybody gets to live 65 years. Um, it's my first birthday without Sky. It's also another birthday without a lot of my kids, but I have some of my kids, so I'm grateful. But I have all you guys. I keep thinking, 
of Stacy's card yesterday, which is out in my living room on the table. And um, she wrote in there and she said, you bring light into, you know, so many lives, something like that. And I keep thinking, no, that's not me doing that. That's you guys doing that for me. And, um, wow. <laughs> what do you do with that? 15 minutes. I'm going to stop here. I'm not even going to get into a topic because that, that would just take away from this. And I don't want anything to take away from this. Mary, thank you so much. You have that was amazing <laughs> that was like i'm gonna play that i swear a million times i'm gonna play that thank you uh what do you say what do you say but thank you you guys i love you so much i am 10 people away from 700 subscribers. When this channel was going before Sky passed away, just as he was ill, I had about 220 or 215 people. Sky passed away, I changed the channel name to The Wayward Widow, and I'm at almost 700, which tells me there's so many amazing people I have met along the way that has brought me out of my shell, has created um, less anxiety in me that's given me the okay to talk to people on the phone through through messages to give people hope that they give people give me hope like I'm forming bonds and that are like absolutely unbreakable there's an amazing group of people out there men and women not a lot of men but the couple the couple um, and one is my son, Corey, and I'm always going to mention my, my YouTube son, Corey. Um, Corey has been with me since way back, like since 2017, and I love Corey so much. He is so sweet. Um, I'm like his YouTube mom. And, um, and then there's one other um, gentleman that I am in correspondence with and uh, and I'm so appreciative of that person and uh, all these beautiful women the amount of strength that we show as we go through things um, and um, Liam you and I don't talk over on messenger but feel free to at any point to come over on messenger on Facebook if you want to I'm under poet Quinn anybody can and we can talk there but you're with me here in the comments all the time and I so appreciate you all of your um, suggestions and your the way you lift me up um, I'm so happy for you that you found happiness again after your loss I'm so blessed this is what blessings are to me like that's the meaning for me so i'm gonna go i have some coffee sitting here i have a card to listen to again <laughs> so thank you remember to put the oxygen mask on you first and more than anything thank you guys for choosing me this channel the wayward widow thank you for being here as i go through the post death of my partner Thank you for loving me and loving Sky the way that you have. Thank you for sharing your stories, your journey, what you're walking through, what you've gone through, how you're managing, how you're not managing. The way that we reach out for each other throughout the day and the night to try to keep going, to keep moving forward, to keep figuring it out. What do we do now? And for those who haven't lost their partner, but have reached out to me and we formed this like this, I've never had this, not ever. And I'm so grateful, like I am so grateful. So all I can say is thank you for being here with me 
so that I can be here with you. And that's it. I'm not going to go on and on, but I could. You know me. Um, uh, pain is inevitable. Suffering is optional. I think we're all going to have suffering, but I think the goal is to make it easier and gentler, right? I'll see you soon.